Hello guys, uh, welcome to this video. Um, in this video, I'll be looking at task 14b. The question says, open the document you saved in task 14a. Add the text winter, winter wonderland or woe. Let me just copy that, okay? As a new main heading at the start of the document, right? So first of all, let me open 14a, uh, okay? Let me just open the task and then add the text. So let me just uh, press the enter button and then right click and then add that text right there. So it becomes a heading. All right. So um, the next thing is to add the text school closure as a subheading before the second paragraph. So I'm going to actually copy this one here. Let me cut it as a matter of fact and then paste it right here. Okay. Let me just put this piece a bit. Okay, so I've copied this this subheading here and then pasted it at the second, uh, just right before the second paragraph. Okay, so create a uh, store and use the following styles in this document. So let's start using the uh, each of these styles here. So for the heading, let's select the heading. So this will be the heading. Uh, this heading has to be sans serif font and then 24 points so let's have an area which is a sans serif font and then make it 24 points okay and then right align bold and italic we want to make sure it is uh, right aligned we want to make it bold and uh, italic okay <laughs> my son is calling <laughs> all right so uh single line spacing zero and then um, zero spacing before and then six point spacing after so we can do that in the paragraph so we can enlarge this and then make the after to be six point of course has uh before zero point and then of course a single line spacing which is okay so we can okay that right there okay so any other thing for that nothing so what i'm going to do is to save um we want to save this so let me save this um style okay so let me save it as 14 b sorry 14 b underscore uh header heading so let me call it heading now okay and then okay that all right so the next thing is for us to also let's style the subheading okay so let's style the first uh, subheading here i'll select that and then um, of course it's sans serif which is area and then 60 point so let's make it area sans serif and then um, 16 point the next thing is uh, center aligned and then underlined so we want to make it uh, underlined and then center aligned okay single line spacing zero uh spacing before so let's also click on the double post launcher and then make it six point single line spacing am i correct yes yeah, zero spacing before and then six point after so i want to okay that right so what i'm gonna do so let's save this this style also so let's call it 14b underscore subheading okay and then i'll okay that so i want to apply that to the second um the second heading here so i'm gonna just click and then that will be applied all right so the last one will be the body the body text so i'm gonna click i'm gonna just select the first paragraph and then apply that and then save save, them, save, save it later right so I will have a sans serif, sorry serif font and then eleven points. So serif point uh, serif font is going to be mid times Roman, and then of course uh, the font size will be eleven. Okay, and then left aligned. Want to make it okay? So already on left aligned, and then single line spacing. I want to have it right here. Single line spacing. Okay, it's already single then how many points after zero point before and then 11 points after so we want to give it uh, 11 points so let me just remove this uh, 12 and then have one right there 
okay so we can okay that so let's save it okay so we're going to add it to the rest of the paragraphs so i'm going to have it as a 14 b underscore body okay and then okay that so i want to apply to the rest of the paragraph so i'm going to select this paragraph i want to apply 14 b uh, body okay and then um, please um, adjust your text to uh, be um, all I say arranged so I want to also select all these paragraphs here including this place so I want to add I want to uh, you know give it the, the style right so the next now I want to actually adjust this guide to be this way so the table sorry this table here I want to adjust it a little more uh, I think I will get rid of this um, the drawing the line let me just get it off okay so this is how let me just also adjust this further more just to have it so so that everything will get to this point so I want to backspace this one so that everything will look good I want to adjust this table too. Let me adjust just adjust the table and then bring it to this side, and then it will look, um, you know, presentable. All right. So I think uh, that's about it for this um, question. So finally, before we go, we want to save this as task 14B. So I'll go to File, Save As, Browse, and then save it as task 14 b okay so i'll save that i think we're done with that question right there so if you have any question please leave a comment down below i'll be happy to reply you if you have any suggestion or also also have a comment down there and then please don't forget to share the video and like the video thanks so much i will see you in the next one